breaking American air dominance and igniting the skies of the Middle East and Asia. NATO and China's neighbors have been watching it for decades with a mixture of interest and disdain, believing that the Red Eagle fighters are just inferior Chinese copies that will not be able to face the American F-35 stealth fighter. Although the Chinese fighter is not as stealthy as its American rival, its combat capabilities make it a real threat on the battlefield. While the F-35 relies on technology and stealth, the Red Eagle J-16 is based on missiles beyond the range of vision, taking out Israeli aircraft closest to Egypt. What is the story of this fighter that the Egyptian army is trying to acquire? Will it be able to shoot down the Israeli F-35 Adir? Many secrets and details will be revealed to you, dear viewer, in this video. Stay tuned. A new Egyptian Red Eagle semi-stealth fighter. After its attempts, to purchase US F-35 stealth fighters faltered due to political pressure and US restrictions on advanced weapons exports, Egypt turned to boosting its air capabilities through a new deal with China. The deal included the purchase of FC-31 Jirfalcon stealth fighters along with J-10C and J-16 semi-stealth fighters in a strategic move aimed at diversifying sources of armaments and strengthening the Egyptian Air Force. These aircraft are characterized by advanced technology that gives Egypt a greater ability to impose air superiority in the region, especially in light of the continuous modernization of its military system to face regional challenges. Combat capabilities between the Red Eagle J-16 and the Israeli F-35 Adir. The F-35 has an advanced arsenal but is limited in terms of payload as it is designed to hide its weapons inside the fuselage to minimize the radar footprint. Adir can carry eight advanced air-to-air -air missiles, such as AM-120 Amram and AM-9X Sidewinder, as well as laser-guided bombs such as the GBU-1000, which has the ability to penetrate underground fortifications. It also has a 25mm GAU-22A quad-barrel rotary cannon with a range of 6,700 meters. In contrast, the J-16 is clearly superior in terms of combat payload, as it has 12 external suspension points with a payload of up to 8,000 kilograms, almost twice as much as the F-35. It can carry eight of PL-15 long-range air-to-air missiles and four of PL-9 short-range missiles. It also has a terrifying offensive capability thanks to long-range cruise missiles such as the YJ-12 and YJ-83, which allow it to target ships and military bases from a safe range, in addition to being equipped with a 30mm machine gun with a range of 8 kilometers, giving it an advantage in close engagements. On the combat side, the J-16 clearly excels in arsenal size and diversity, while the F-35 has more advanced and accurate munitions, which makes the confrontation depend on the nature of the fight. In long-range combat, the Chinese fighter has air-to-air -air missiles that pose a great threat to Israeli fighters. And on the other hand, the Israeli Adir has a surveillance radar that makes it the upper hand in fighting behind the sighting range. Combat systems between the Red Eagle J-16 and the Israeli F-35 Adir. The F-35 is a fully stealthy aircraft, meaning that most of its combat systems rely on electronic stealth and advanced technology. It is equipped with an ASAR APG-81 radar that can detect enemy air defenses up to 720 kilometers away and can disrupt and blind enemy systems. In addition, the pilot has an advanced helmet that displays all combat data, giving him unparalleled situational awareness. The Chinese Red Eagle is not stealthy, but it has powerful electronic capabilities, as it is equipped with a homemade ASA radar 
capable of detecting enemy aircraft at a range of 200 kilometers. The J-16 is equipped with advanced electronic jamming systems and infrared sensors that allow it to detect stealth aircraft through their heat signature and it can communicate with Chinese satellites, giving it the ability to carry out complex missions in coordination with ground forces. Despite the J-16's superiority in electronic jamming and thermal imaging, the F-35 excels in stealth and intelligent systems, meaning the Egyptian J-16 may not be able to detect an Israel target in time. Speed and Exoskeleton between the Red Eagle and Israel's F-35 Adir. The J-16 is larger, measuring 22 meters long, compared to the F-35's 15.7 meters, giving it more room to carry fuel and weapons, but it is also heavier, weighing 35 tons at takeoff, compared to 31.7 tons for its American rival. In terms of performance, the J-16 is superior in speed and altitude, as it can fly at 2 Mach equivalent 2,450 km per hour compared to 1.6 Mach equivalent 1,780 km per hour for the F-35 and its operational range is up to 4,000 km while the F-35's range does not exceed 2,900 km. If we consider the criterion to be speed and range, the J-16 is superior but the F-35 does not need speed, as it relies on stealth and first strike before the enemy detects it. Strengths between the Red Eagle and the Israeli Adir The F-35 excels in stealth thanks to its stealthy design and advanced electronic systems giving it the ability to strike the enemy undetected. It also possesses advanced field awareness, thanks to its smart helmet and radar, capable of detecting targets at long distances, making it ideal for air control and precision operations. The J-16 excels in firepower and range and speed, as it can carry almost twice the amount of weapons as the F-35, making it a formidable attack platform against air and sea and land targets. It also has a longer range and higher speed, giving it an advantage in long-range battles and open-air engagements. In the case of close engagement, the J-16 may have difficulty spotting the F-35 before it is attacked, but if it manages to get close, its massive armament gives it a chance to shoot down the American Lightning. In long-range offensive operations, the J-16 is capable of carrying long-range cruise missiles unlike the US F-35, making it a threat to US bases in the Pacific. In conclusion, dear viewer, the better pilot and the better tactician will prevail. Which do you think will be the master of the confrontation? Let us know in the comments, and don't forget to support us by liking the video and subscribing to the channel. Thanks for watching.